welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I'm Mr. Zaman and today I'm going to talk about COVID-19 linked to a 72% increased diagnosis of type 1 diabetes in youth. Children who were infected with COVID-19 show a substantially higher risk of developing type 1 diabetes or T1D according to a new study that analyzed electronic health records of more than 1 million patients aged 18 and younger. The findings showed a 72% increase in new diagnosis of type 1 diabetes in COVID-19 patients. Although the research emphasized that it is unclear whether COVID-19 triggers new onset of type 1 diabetes, about 1,87,000 children and adolescents younger than 20 live with T1D nationally, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. The team analyzed the de-identified electronic health records of nearly 1.1 million patients aged 18 years and younger in the United States and 13 other countries diagnosed with the SARS-CoV-2 infection between March 2020 and December 2021, and also those diagnosed with a non-COVID-related respiratory infection during that same period. The research team found that among the more than 5,71,000 pediatric patients, within six months of SARS-CoV-2 infection, 123 patients had received a new diagnosis of type 1 diabetes, compared to 72 patients who received a new diagnosis following a non-COVID respiratory infection, an increase of 72% in new diagnosis. At 1, 3 and 6 months following infection, the risk of diagnosis of type 1 diabetes was substantially greater for those infected with SARS-CoV-2 compared to those with non-COVID respiratory infection. Similar results were reported with patients in the infant 9-year-old and 10-18-year-old age groups. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe, and press the bell icon.